Soybeans across North Carolina are starting to flower, which is going to trigger management action in the early reproductive growth stages. We want to have a fundamental understanding of how to assess soybean growth stages. Soybean growth stage R1 is beginning flowering, where you're looking for one open soybean flower on the main stem. On average, one to seven days after the plant begins to flower, we should be at full flower where you're looking for open flowers all along the main stem. But what you're looking for in particular is open flowers at the upper two most nodes on the soybean plant that have a fully developed leaf. Five to 15 days after the soybean plant is in full flower, it will move into R3 or beginning pod. At this growth stage, you're looking for a three 16 inch long pod in the upper four nodes of the plant that have a fully developed leaf. Why look in the four uppermost nodes? Well, at this point in soybean development, you can have larger pods, you can have flowers on the main stem. And so for consistency purposes, from R3 to R6, you're looking at the four uppermost nodes that have a fully developed leaf. As with all soybean growth stages, you wanna to go to multiple spots throughout the field to get a good understanding of what growth stage you're at. And when 50% of the plants have reached that point in development, then you've moved on to the next growth stage. So think about how to accurately assess these growth stages as soybeans move into re early reproductive development. So you can use this to trigger management decisions at this point in the season.